right, we are going to read a story today that is about the alphabet. Have you learned about the alphabet? Yeah. Yes. Okay, we're, we're not going to sing the whole thing right now, but we, we know the alphabet. Do you have a favorite letter of the alphabet? Okay. Okay, K, thanks for raising your hand. What's your favorite letter of the alphabet? K, what's your favorite letter? N, what's your favorite letter? What's your favorite letter? So we're going to read a book about the alphabet today, and you can look for your favorite letter. It has really beautiful pictures of animals. This is very cool. It is very is cool. My, yeah, oh, this is real. 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 I love zebras. So what do you call a book that is about real things? Fiction. Non-fiction. Non-fiction. So this is a non-fiction book with real photographs. And you could probably see all these ones up here. Do you know what letters all of these start with? Here, I'm going to point to one, and you tell me which letter it starts with. This is a giraffe, so it's a G. It kind of sounds like a J, doesn't it? But it's a G. Like Gianna, my How about zebra? P. How about parrot? P. How about lion? J. Lion. Lion. How about camel? No, it's not. That's tricky. Could be it's a C. Sometimes C makes a sound like a K, but it's a C. And then how about butterfly? So the author of this book took all of the photos for this book. He took all the photos and wrote the words for this book. So he's an author and an illustrator. A, how many people's favorite letter was A? Raise your hand. A is for ant eater. Put your hands down. In search of a snack. B, anybody have a favorite letter B? B is for butterfly. Why, Shin? In orange and black. E is for elephant, who uses its trunk to eat and drink. That's my favorite That's my favorite because it starts with my sister, Olivia. That's great. That's my favorite because it starts with my brother, Ethan. And that's my other favorite because it starts with me. I is for iguana. Was on the ground. I wonder how they got a photo of jellyfish. It's a good question. How do you think they got a photo of jellyfish? Then they swam under sea and took a picture of the jellyfish with yeah. their phone in the in the bar. Yeah. I think that's a good idea. But the phone probably broke. J is for jellyfish. No. Floating no. around. K is for kudus, resting as it gets hotter. K! Yeah, K. Have you ever seen an animal like this? No! Never! This is an unusual one, isn't it? O is for owl, big eyes open wide. Can you open your eyes big like an owl? P is for praying mantis, trying to hide. Oh, They're trying to hide because sometimes other animals want to eat them. So they kind of want to look like, what does this kind of look like? It kind of looks like a stick, doesn't it? So they want to look like a stick so other animals can't find them and eat them. Okay, good, we're done. Like what animal? Not sure. Owl? Q is for quail who's wandering free. And R is for rhinoceros. That is the next one. That's the next one. As big as can be. Yeah. Oh, I my name. Okay, hands down. Yep. V is for vulture that circles when it spots its prey. Prey is the animal that is trying to catch and eat. That's a good question. Does it, have you ever seen a bird like that before? No. It's a really interesting face, isn't it? Yeah, vultures circle around, they fly around up in the sky until they find something that they can eat. They often eat animals that are dead already. They eat dead animals? Yes. Could they eat they dead do. fish? They, they could eat dead even fish. Even can eat a dead fish dead. I mean, the fish that is dead. And they'll eat us if they're, if they're dead. 
X is what? for x-ray fish that you can see right what? through. What? No, that's mine. No, Look at this fish. Mine. Look at this fish right here. I got bones. It looks, you can see the bones inside the fish or whatever it has inside of it. It's Okay. You can see through an x-ray fish. You can see through an x-ray fish. Why is for yak with horns left and right. Man, it just kind of looks like it. Z I is, love zebras. I don't. Z is for zebra, half black and half white. I know. I love them. I know you can go black. In the jungle, the forest or the ocean blue. The wonders of nature are waiting for you.